Hey, this is Coach Agent, and welcome to day 15 of your 30 day plank challenge. We are halfway. So, for this one, we're actually going to go into a side plank. So, we're going to be doing half of your one side, then we're going to flip over and do half on the other side. So, side plank position, what I want you to do is get your forearm down on the mat. You can put your hand down on the mat if you want. Get as much of your forearm down on the mat as possible. This is going to give you a nice, strong base. Now, the options with your legs is you can bend your bottom leg, so make sure the shin and foot is on the floor. You can go down to both legs, you're in this position and they're both bent. So we've still got your knees, hips and shoulders in a straight line. From there, you can extend that top leg, so that's straight. You can stack your feet, so they're both uh, one on top of the other, or scissor one in front of the other. Okay, it's entirely up to you how you go. So like I said, what we're gonna do is we're gonna aim for 90 seconds on one side, then we're gonna do a quick flip round to the other side. So let's get ourselves ready. Ready for your countdown. Three, two, one. Let's lift and hold. So whichever position you're going into. And then what I want you to do is once you're in this position, think about your head. So we're not letting air drop the shoulder. We're not looking down. I want you just to lift the head and look straight ahead. I'll keep an eye on the time. I'll let you know when we're sort of 30 seconds. I'll give you a few more regular countdowns for this position. And we're going to focus now on working those obliques, those side muscles. So nice and strong. Lovely. So that's 30 seconds. So if you are going for a 30 second hold, relax. And like I said, I'll give you a few more regular countdowns for this position as it's going to be a challenging hold. Hand can be here. I know some people when they side plank like to raise the arm in the air. So it's wherever you feel comfortable. That's 45 seconds. So nice and strong. Keep breathing. And like I said, if you're in that full position where you're on your feet, you can always come down and bend that bottom leg and just adjust. That's a minute, and you can adjust that position. But when you keep breathing, like I said, really feel those sides working hard. It's quite a challenging hold, this one. But I figure we're halfway, it's around about time we hit that side plank. 75 seconds down. So we're going to get ready to spin. Okay, in. Three, two, and one. So that's just under 90 seconds. So that gives us enough time to come around to the other end. Okay, again, forearm down, adjust that position. And again, take that side plank, same position you're in. We're just on to the other side. So again, once you're there, think about your head. So again, ear away from the shoulder, we're looking straight ahead. So it's not just about what the abs do when we're in our plank positions, we're always looking after our neck as well. Lovely, we're just coming down Woo, to that final, the last minute, so final 60 seconds right now. So again, like I said, really hold strong, make sure those hips are staying up, so I'm not allowing those hips to drop. If you do feel like they're dropping, come down, relax out of that plank position, you can always pop back up again. And there's seven, 45 seconds left. So we're 45 here right now. Keep breathing, keep breathing. Before you like this one at halfway. Nice. So we are now coming down to that final 30 seconds. So if you're still with me, keep holding strong. Again, wherever you want that arm to be. And we are down to 20 seconds. Awesome, well done. And let's finish it off with our final 10. So we've got to wait for that little buzz of the sounds. Whoa, nice strong few seconds now. And there it is. Oh, that lovely sound that we like. Lovely stuff, well done. So like I said, side plank, great exercise. Really gets into those oblique muscles, those side muscles. So I figured, like I said, as we're halfway, it's about time we changed up that plank a little bit and get those sides working hard. Well, hey, you enjoyed that one. Like I said, when you do the side plank, you've got lots of variations with the feet. So as you get more used to it, if you are on bent leg, then you can go to that top leg straight up and keep that bottom leg down. And then eventually go to both legs out straight, scissored or stacked. It's a really challenging position. It's not one you do in a lot of classes where you hold for huge amounts of time. So that's why it can be quite tough. But it's great for those sides. Anyway, that's day 15 done. So we hit that halfway point, which is fantastic. It's all countdown from now on in. So anyway, I'm Coach Agent. Until tomorrow, till day 16, have a great day and I shall see you then.